Hey everybody, um, Trina here with Primal Life Organics and um, I want to talk a little bit today about creating a spa experience for yourself at home, bringing the spa to you. I've struggled in the past with going to get facials and um, having these really good treatments done because I know that the ingredients that are in there aren't the best and while I want the experience of relaxing and I really want to have um, like I, I want my skin to have some something out of the ordinary something that it doesn't get every day because in everyday life um, things happen and you're lucky if you even get to the bathroom if you're like me to wash your face sometimes so creating 20 minutes a half an hour an hour to go to the spa is sometimes really hard to fit in and I know that um, if I don't put it on my calendar ahead of time it just doesn't get done so what I want to show you today is how you can bring that spa experience home to yourself and it's um, it is spa grade and it's actually works better than a spa um, because you can do it whenever you want you can do it two times a week you can do it three times a week and it doesn't take long at all you can continue to go about your day or you can sit down relax with a book so you can make it a spa experience for yourself or you can just implement it into your daily life and um, have that special treatment for your skin so today I'm going to show you exactly what I use um, to create my own spa experience and I try to do this treatment at least once a week if not twice a week and I love to do it on Sunday nights because I feel like it preps me for the week um, and sometimes I like to do it on Wednesday nights it's just kind of a midweek pick me up so I'm gonna talk about it's gonna be fire and ice is the spa treatment but I'm gonna go through the process of what I do to create a whole spa experience for your face because it's not just fire and ice it's all about the experience you're creating so the first thing I'm gonna talk about so let me show you what I have here so this is all my fun spa stuff so I'm gonna start with my face wash and um, the face wash that I use is either the earth or the ocean and I'll wash my face so that's gonna get everything clean and nice and prepped I'm gonna actually wash it with quiver if you haven't seen quiver before quiver is our sonic um, it's a sonic face cleanser so it vibrates like a sonic toothbrush and what that does is it opens your pores so while it's opening your pores it's pulling out all of the debris the oil the grime the dirt it's exfoliating and it's also since it's opening those pores it's going to let anything you put on it penetrate better so it's going to give your spa experience so much more oomph okay got it um the other thing it does is because it's vibrating it's going to help tone your skin so it's gonna help bring your skin and your tissue to a better tone so you look younger and more vibrant so who doesn't want that super exciting so I'm going to show you how to use the quiver the quiver is not available on the website yet you can still get it let me turn down that volume really quick all right um so you can still get it through the pre-order site um, until we run out of the pre-orders and hey Elizabeth from New York glad you're um, listening or watching if you have any questions guys type them below I'm gonna be monitoring questions so um, type them below so quiver can be ordered pre-ordered through uh, quiver facial spa.com it's amazing and it's a great tool so it's a part of the spa experience so next I'm going to do a an exfoliation as well with Dirty X Sweet Revenge. That is a sugar scrub and the sugar will help exfoliate. It has some caffeine that helps to tighten and open your pores. And uh, then after that, I'm going to do my toner. This is the Infinity Toner. This is gonna prep my skin for the final step, which is fire and ice. Do you still make bear? I do still make bear, um, Elizabeth. I still do make bear. Um, the bear face wash and the bear moisturizer are still available on the website, yes. So here's fire and here's ice. So I, I, these, um, I, I'm gonna talk about these when I put them on my face so I can tell you exactly what they're doing to me and how it feels. Uh, so first, let me go through this washing my face. At the very end, um, don't let me forget, I wanna put my makeup, uh, just my foundation on, that's all I have, foundation. Um, but I wanna put the foundation on because I want you guys to see exactly how the foundation works as well. Because if you didn't know I make makeup, I make makeup and I love my makeup. Um, all right, so I have my little bowl of water. <laughs> Thanks you guys, I love the love. Send me more love. Um, it's hard to do this one-sided sometimes, so it's always good to see um, everybody. All right, so face wash is what you need. So um, the face wash that I make 
is an oil base, but it's not oily. It's um, saponified oils. So the good nutrients are still there, but it's not going to leave your, so I just wet my hand down and I put a couple drops. You don't need a lot. It will lather up. So it's not going to strip your natural oils. Oh, you're welcome, Elizabeth. Oh, pure ingredients are all, that I'm all about pure ingredients, food grade ingredients, um, nourishing your skin from the outside, um, your body, really, it's nourishing your body from the outside. Did you guys know, as I'm washing my face, did you know that what you put on your skin gets absorbed and it doesn't follow the same path as when you ingest something? When you ingest food, it goes to your mouth, it starts to get broken down, and then it travels to your stomach where it gets broken down more and the toxins and things like that that you've ingested can be sent to your liver to be converted from a lipid soluble to a water soluble type of um, molecule so that it can then be excreted in your urine. So that's a protective mechanism that you have when you ingest something. Did you know that when you put something on your skin as simple as washing your face, SLS, triclosan, anything like that that's in those um, face washes gets absorbed into your tissues but it doesn't go to your liver. It goes into your bloodstream, travels throughout your body and because it loves fatty tissue it can it can migrate anywhere, including your brain, um, including your breast tissue, including any fatty tissue around your organs. So that's part of the problem with commercial skincare and the fact that they have ingredients in there that are toxic and harmful is because you don't really know how much you're absorbing. You don't really know what, you're using multiple products every day and if every single one of those products has harmful ingredients that are neurotoxins, endocrine disruptors, cancer causing ingredients, you don't know what happens when they go inside your body. It's kind of like a, you know, just, it, it's a roulette that you're playing. So my theory behind this is if you're going to absorb this stuff, you better make it good. Make it good so it nourishes you and your cells love it because if your cells are happy, they're gonna look good. Uh, guys, I just celebrated my 49th birthday yesterday, so happy birthday to me. Uh, yes, it is my skincare that helps me look so beautiful and young. Um, I'm washing my face off. Sorry, <laughs> you guys are awesome for listening to me. Which face? I, I'm right now. I have the. Um, this is the ocean. You can use earth or ocean or bear. Um, thank you, Elizabeth. Um, earth, ocean, air, bear are the face washes. I also make pomegranate, and I make pomegranate is for um, drier skin, and then the carrot seed is for more oily skin. When you dry your face, do not. Do not rub your tissue on your face. It's so delicate, guys. Delicate. Okay, so really gentle. All you want to do is tap your skin. Do not rub. Just tap. It's a tap. And you don't want to pull your tissue under your eyes either. It's even more delicate, more delicate. So um, anyway, that's what you do. So my girls are watching, so they're answering questions for me because whew, it's hard to multitask when you have two hands. All right, so um, let's see. The next thing, oh, I wanted to show you guys Quiver. Um, I will show you Quiver when I'm putting on, so you can wash with Quiver. What I should have done, I was too busy telling you about how, when you ingest things. So what I should have done is put my face wash on my face, and what you can do is you turn Quiver on right here, and you can adjust the speed. Um, there's a plus and a minus right here. Oh, I'm doing the minus, I think. So that was taking it down, but you can hear it vibrate. You can see, um, the touch pad there, this is silicone. It's really soft and gentle. It's great for sensitive skin. But what I could have done when I had my face wash on is just massage it in while it was on my face. It feels good even without. I call it quiver because when you're done, your face quivers. Don't forget your lips. It's amazing to do this on your lips. Um, so everywhere your face wash, you wash your face. You can do it on your neck. It helps. So this is what I do with my face wash. And then um, I'll do it again when I put fire and ice on. That is gonna blow fire and ice into your skin um, because your pores will open up. That helps open up your pores. This part right here, if you can see, has a little bit, this touch point, any areas that you have um, trouble with, if you have an acne lesion or any discolorations or scars or anything like that, that touch point helps um, even more. So next thing I wanna do is, I wanna show you guys, this is the Dirty X Sweet Revenge. Um, and it's a sugar scrub. You can see that big white chunk in there. Ooh, don't be afraid of that. 
um, that big white chunk is your friend. That is caffeine, it's like a caffeine crystal, and that is amazing for your skin. It helps to tone and tighten. So you can either use a little scoop or a spoon. I usually just take about this much. You really don't need much. This will last you a really long time. Um, how is this one different from the others that are similar? So you, I know there are some that have brush heads that need to be replaced. This is one time purchase, no replacement for brush heads. This silicone doesn't wear out and it, it's rechargeable. There's a little USB cable that comes with it. Rechargeable, oh, you can get about 200 uses out of one charge, take it with you. So um, it's, it's amazing. All right, so I have, this is the um, sugar scrub. This is the Dirty X Sweet Revenge. Guys, all of this stuff is on sale. So if you're interested in creating your own spot home, um, I'll give you, I'll post the sale coupon all right, so you just want to scrub it in. You can go gentle if you want. The sugar sometimes, it really gives you a really great exfoliation. So my question to you is, do you think it's important to exfoliate? Do you think it's necessary? Do you think it's um, going to help? Oh, how do you keep it clean? Um, it's waterproof. You can take quiver in the shower. And um, that's usually what I do. Watch, I'm gonna, you can't see it, but watch, I'm gonna drop it right in the water. It's floating in the water. I'm gonna take it out, turn it on. I can probably actually do it with my, oh, it feels good with, this, uh, with the um, Sweet Revenge. Um, it's waterproof. So all you have to do is if uh, rinse it under water, especially if you're just using soap, you can just rinse it. Or if you really wanna wash it off, you can just use a little bit of the mild soap. I just use whatever soap I'm using and then um, just rinse it under the water. But that's all that you, it's no maintenance. I take this with me when I travel because it's so simple, so simple. Okay, so that is Sweet Revenge. My skin feels really good. I'm just gonna wash it off. If I wasn't talking to you guys, this wouldn't take me near as long. So I don't want you to feel like your spa experience is gonna take you six hours at home. But um, really, washing your face and doing this whole system, this probably would take me about two to three minutes at home. The quiver you want to use for about two minutes. So as I'm washing, I would have used it for about two minutes and then done my exfoliation. So the next thing I'm going to do is tone my skin. So the toner, this is the Infinity Toner, and it sets... You can do three or four spritzes. It sets your skin. It helps to open up your pores so that when you put on fire and ice... You're gonna, you're gonna get blown away. Like the fire and ice are really gonna absorb. So fire and ice is the next step. So it's a two-step system that I created um, to give you that spa experience at home. To give your skin something out of the ordinary, something it's not used to, to give it a treat, a special treat that you can do in the luxury of your own home, in your pajamas, looking like this, <laughs> with your hair kind of like all crazy, um, and your kids running around in the background going, Mom, what are you doing? So a warning about fire and ice with kids, if, you're gonna, if you have kids, um, you want to do this when they go to bed, because just like everything else, what you put on your skin, um, they could, if they kiss you, they are going to um, feel it, and I'm gonna talk about fire, and it heats up, and they may not like that that spicy heat. Uh, what type of skin can use these? Okay, so Elizabeth, any type of skin. It's good for all skin types, okay? Um, even acne prone skin. The fire and ice is really good, and I'm gonna go into what fire and ice, um, what's in it and how it works. So let me show you exactly how to use it. So this is fire. This is the first step. So what you wanna do is put, I'm gonna show you the color of it. This is why we call it fire. So it has cayenne pepper, I'm gonna go in all the ingredients, but it has cayenne pepper infused into the oil. So I'm gonna put one drop on my forehead, you can see it, one drop on my cheek, one drop on this other cheek, and then one drop on my chin. Where'd my bottle go? Oh, down there, okay. So then I'm going to, this is funny, I'm using my phone. Sorry guys, all right. I wish you could smell this. It smells so rich. Um, 
it's an experience. If you have used this more than once, I suggest going down on your neck and then continuing it onto your neck. If you have never used it and it's your first time, I suggest just doing it on your face. <laughs> Um, because you, until you know exactly how it feels, um, I don't want it to drive you crazy on your neck. Your neck might be a little more sensitive. You want to stay away from your eyes. You don't want to get too close to your eyes. Um, just stay a circle away. You also want to stay around, away from your lips. If you get it on your lips, it's okay. If it gets in your eyes, it's fine as well. So it has cayenne pepper in it. I'm going to put my glasses on. I'm going to explain to you guys exactly what fire and ice does. Okay, so the fire and ice is the spa treatment that I created that you can do at home. It will help tone, tighten, and lift your facial tissue. It's going to improve circulation. I'm going to explain why and how. It decreases the congestion of your skin. It improves your skin tone and texture, improves your complexion clarity, it helps to fade scars, any kind of scars you have from acne or anything. Um, it helps to improve acne and it facilitates detoxif detoxification of the skin. Huge, it does that. Um, so first off, fire has cayenne pepper in it. So that's why it's red. So the cayenne pepper, this is what cayenne pepper does. This is why I, I love this product. So it has a lot of amazing properties, but it, it, it including pain relief and reducing inflammation. That's the main thing, like it reduces any kind of inflammation in your skin. Applying cayenne pepper topically um, improves both minor and major blemishes as well as the look and feel of your skin. Cayenne pepper increases the blood flow to the skin, which increases oxygen and many essential nutrients that will aid in healing. So the capsium, capsium that's in cayenne pepper, that's the ingredient that gets hot and spicy. When you eat a hot pepper, you're, you're tasting the capsium. That's the ingredient that makes it hot. But it does also have mild antibacterials and antibacterial properties that can kill some of the bacteria that can cause acne and other skin issues. That is also the property that is responsible for that heat, that sensation of heat. So right now as I'm talking to you, I'm starting to feel warm. Like my whole face gets really heated up. I can feel tingly sensation. It's not unbearable, it's just you know it's there. If you've used Banished, my blemish serum for acne, it's very similar. Although this one with the Banished Blemish Serum, um, it has the, the cayenne pepper and it also has a little bit of the cooling agent in it, whereas this one it's separated out. I separated it out because I want that heat to build in my skin. As it's building the blood flow, it's just dilating those blood vessels so that anything that you put on your skin is gonna be absorbed better and it's also gonna penetrate deeper and um, heal faster. So that's why I did that with the cayenne pepper. It's amazing. So the other ingredients that are in fire is um, palmarosa. Palmarosa, is a, it helps moisturize the skin. It balances hydration levels and stimulate, stimulates cell regeneration. So think about that. How, what a bonus because your skin is like literally the circulation is increased and you're getting like cell regeneration stimulated. It balances the production of sebum and helps the skin to stay supple and elastic. It also helps prevent scarring, helps rejuvenate the skin and uh, fight minor infections. Peru balsam is also in fire. It nourishes, soothes, and smooths dry skin. It's perfect for um, mature skin and helps protect against aging like wrinkling and chapping of the skin. It also um, helps to prevent moisture loss. Um, it helps to keep the moisture level in your skin and not out. So, uh, And then pedigree is another ingredient that's in the fire that I have on right now. It's beneficial to help clear up congested skin, acne, pimples, scars, and other skin-related um, problems. And it has toning properties too, so it's going to help to tone your skin, make it feel really good. So that's what's in fire. So you put fire on, you put it on one drop, one drop, one drop, one drop. You just want to kind of moisturize it in. If you notice, that was plenty to do my, my face and my neck. You leave it on for about 15 minutes. That heat is going to build. I feel it. So you want to do this um, probably before you go to bed. You don't really want to do this um, in the morning unless you really have nothing going on. You don't want to do this and then go work out because if you sweat, 
you're going to sweat that into your eyes. If you get it into your eyes, it's okay. It will just cause that tingly burning sensation um, and tearing, you'll probably tear. You can just put some water in your eyes, just kind of do a flush. It's not gonna harm your eyes. They actually make eye drops with the cayenne pepper in it. So it's not gonna hurt your eyes, it's just going to make you tear and um, you, you probably won't be able to see very well for about five or 10 minutes. Um, but it goes away in about 10 minutes. In about 15 minutes, um, I'm gonna pretend like I've had this on for 15 minutes. What you wanna do is then apply ice. You can apply the ice right over your fire. So your blood supply is increased. You've got all these good nutrients going in and then you're gonna put fi uh, ice on. I'm gonna tell you once I put it on what's in ice. So you just wanna do a little quick shake. You're gonna apply it the same way. You don't have to rinse fire off and this takes the place of a moisturizer. So you wanna do this at night um, because this really helps when you're sleeping your skin regenerates a little bit better your body's not working to um, To like do the daily activities. It's not walking. It's not trying to eat It's not trying to do anything. You're really trying to heal your body So it's the best time to use a good skin treatment. So I put one drop you're gonna do the exact same thing so you wait 15 minutes and you just put ice right on over fire and it's called ice because it has menthol in it. So you may or may not feel cooling. Sometimes you feel it, sometimes you don't. Some people are a little more sensitive. You just really put it on right over. Um, and don't worry if you don't feel the cooling. It's just because the heat from fire just keeps you tingling. But I promise you the um, the menthol is in there and it's working. And I'm gonna tell you what menthol does for your skin. It's amazing. Between the cayenne pepper and the menthol, it's that right there alone is a spa treatment. Um, there are spa treatments that you can go and get something similar to this. They have cayenne pepper spa treatments that will cost you somewhere between $125 and $175 per treatment. So being on sale right now, uh, you're gonna get probably 30 to 40 treatments for the price of one spa treatment. That's it. Uh, so it's a super great deal. That's why I wanted to go over this because I know if you're like me, anything you can do at home is amazing. All right, so I talked about the menthol crystal. So this one, you put on, you just leave it on and you're done. This is it, you, you're done, you go about your business, you finish up your nightly routine, you go to bed, you sleep on it. Um, you don't wash this off, you do not need to put anything else on. So these are both oils, they're both oil-based, so this is to replace your moisturizer. You do not need to put a moisturizer on. So let me tell you what ice has in it since I'm here. Okay, so. Let me tell you first that it has the menthol crystals. And like I said, it's not gonna necessarily feel cool. I feel the cooling, like especially when I blow my face like this, I can feel the cooling sensation, but I still feel the fire from heat because that fire penetrates deep into your skin. Now it's deeper into your layers, especially, oh, I should have done this. So once you put them both on, you can use quiver. And when you're using quiver with your fire and ice, it's actually allowing it to penetrate deeper. So I would I should have done this with fire. I'm just talking instead of thinking about it. So I would do this for about one to two minutes, um, and it, mainly because it feels good, and it's really allowing my pores to open so that both of those, the fire and ice, can really penetrate deeper. So I would do this for about two minutes, but I'm going to come back and tell you guys what's in it. So, palm, so the, uh, the menthol crystals. The menthol crystals are the cooling applied topically to an area. They activate your skin's cold, receptive, cold sensitive receptors causing a cool sensation that overrides the irritation from swollen and inflamed tissues. So it helps to decrease any swelling or irritation that you might have. It reduces pain and tenderness and helps to rebalance oil production. So that's what the cooling sensation, the menthol crystals, do. It's amazing for your skin. If you think about doing like, um, I should have done a, cry I, you can do cryotherapy to your face or you can actually imitate like a cryotherapy taking an ice cube and just kind of doing that to your face as well. It's amazing. The menthol will do the same thing. It helps to tone, tighten, and it's going to help um, with the, um, decrease the inflammation in your tissue. So it also contains pomegranate oil that deeply nourishes your skin. Avocado oil um, helps reduce the chance of wrinkles it has vitamin A in it 
that is really neutralize it really neutralizes the harmful effects in our skin so it neutralizes like free radicals and things like that walnut oil is um, really good to help prevent wrinkles tamanu oil is also in ice the reason I put most of these in ice is because I wanted the fire to have 15 minutes to increase the blood flow because now that you've got really good blood flow is when you really want the really nourishing really good oils on there. So Tamanu oil is amazing and it, it really helps to heal the skin and it has really good regenerative properties. Baobab oil, highly moisturizing, has a, a good source of vitamin A, D, E, and F. Sea buckhorn oil is incredible and it helps um, treat damaged skin, ulceration, scar tissue, wrinkles, eczema. When you hear things like that, it's basically there, it's gonna help heal. So it's gonna help your skin look better and um, feel better. Manuka is um, extracted from the leaves of a native New Zealand tree called Manuka. It helps, um, it's got antibacterial properties, antifungal properties, anti-inflammatory properties, but it helps to fade scars and age spots. It promotes growth and regeneration of cells, skin cells. So it's, it's amazing. Um, let's see, it has Lang Lang in them and Lang Lang can be used on all skin types. It's amazing. It helps to treat acne, eczema, other skin irritations, and it helps to balance the production of sebum and helps to uh, fight the signs of aging, which we're all fighting daily. Uh, Myrtle um, is also in ice and it has astringent actions. It also can uh, improve the longe longevity of cells and tissues right there, anti-aging. So uh, Myrtis has anti-inflammatory properties, which is really good for the skin. And Cystis helps to normalize oily skin, reduce puffiness, and promote lymph drainage. So make sure you rub some of that right there on your neck. And then um, Sandalwood helps to diminish the appearance of fine lines and wrinkles. So that's amazing. So that's how you would use that system. So you're done. So really, after you put fire on, you just put it on, you go about your business for 15 minutes, you lay down, you relax, read a book, you do whatever you wanna do, watch a movie, um, set your timer for about 15 minutes, you'll kind of feel it, you'll feel fire starting to dissipate, and then you can go put ice on right over it. And that's your spa treatment. It feels really good. Your senses come alive. The smell is amazing. It just takes you someplace else. And the feeling that you get from your skin, you know that it's working. You can feel it penetrating. And I know this because tomorrow, I'm gonna still, when I put water in my face, I can sometimes still feel the fire in my tissue. Um, if I were to put this on at night and then go do hot yoga in the morning, I would, when I'm sweating with the hot yoga, I would, feel it coming down into my eyes and my eyes would water a little bit. So that's how you know your skincare really is penetrating. This is proof. So this is a great spa treatment. Everything, I'm gonna put the, um, the link and the coupon code above um, and you can get everything that I used with the exception of Quiver. Quiver, you have to go to the Quiver uh, quiverfacialspa.com. This is already discounted. Um, everything else is 25% off. Um, so if you use the coupon code SMOLDER, S-M-O-L-D-E-R, you get 25% off um, anything that I use today. And I'll do the earth and the, um, the ocean face wash because both of those are um, perfect to use with this. Oh, I wanted to put on my um, foundation. See, I knew I was going to almost forget. So uh, using fire and ice. Oh my gosh, that's awesome, awesome, Cheryl. Thank you. Um, yes, you can use it on your back. You can actually use it anywhere. It works out. It works really good. So um, here is, this is the uh, foundation. So my powder, my foundation is like powder. You can use it wet or dry. I'm just gonna put it on dry. Really simple to use. So I'm just scooping some into the palm of my hand. It's made, guys, it's made with clay. And then the color comes from the clay, but it also comes from food like cocoa. Um, all of my makeup, the, the color doesn't come from artificial ingredients and it doesn't come from um, true minerals mineral makeup um, iron oxides and things like that um, have to be washed 
and order to be used for the skincare. And unfortunately, the way they're washed is with chemicals and they're not, those chemicals are on the minerals. So if you're applying something that's like a mineral makeup to your face, you're still putting some toxic ingredients on your face. So when I found that out, I was destroyed and I decided I wasn't going to wear makeup, which lasted about an hour while I started cranking my brain going, how can I make my own? So then I created my own makeup made with clay and the color comes from food. So there are no bad ingredients. They are all nourishing. So I have my makeup brush and all I'm gonna do, and I can't really see on this. I gotta peek in my mirror so I can see. But I'm just gonna put, dust it on. This is just like the dry method that you would use for most types of um, powder type foundations. So you can see how it covers. And now I have a glow. I feel really fresh and my skin is tingly. I can feel the cooling sensation from ice. Um, I can still feel a little bit of the tingle from fire and I can still feel a little bit of the vibration from quiver. So that, my friends, is a spa treatment bringing it home to you. So if you guys have any questions, um, comment below. I will be more than happy to answer questions. Um, I'll come back, but like, comment, sh uh, share this post with anybody you think might be interested in having a spa day at home. Heck, you can get this and share it with a friend. Um, there's plenty here. Get one package and have a spa day with your best friend. Um, that could be amazing too. So anyway, thanks guys for joining me. And I will put the link to this um, in the comments. Um, so look for that. Don't forget the, co the coupon code is SMOLDER. S-M-O-L-D-E-R for 25% off your spa treatment at home. Thanks guys for joining. Have an amazing day.